catch me if you can, Derek. Woo! Trying not to throw up. But to be honest, the start of every race season, it is the hardest thing on our relationship. The tough times really truly just come from us forgetting to turn work off and be a couple. Derek, is my dad wearing your pants? Yeah, I am. They're dirty too. I folded Chuck's underwear before. <laughs> We're race car drivers. I don't know why we decided to live on a farm. And she is gonna sit in this chair and you're gonna ask her the same question and she's gonna say, Derek's never beaten me in a late model. We've raced together twice. We will race against each other in NASCAR again. Sorry, I'm speaking to the camera because this is personal. Game on. Okay, let's go. In my dream world, I would be racing every single weekend. And sadly, that's just not my reality right now. So I really wish that all my sponsorship was all figured out and I was doing the full schedule. I don't know my schedule. I really don't know when I'm gonna be on track again next. And that makes it really difficult for me because there's a lot behind the scenes that a lot of people don't see in my life that I have to take care of. The number one thing is my health. And another thing is family. You know, family comes first before your job and your career. And that's really important to me. But I want more. I wanna be at the track more. And we just have to keep working at it. And I'm really thankful I get to do that with my family because then the days are more enjoyable as we're working towards our bigger goals and bigger dreams. Here we go. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to my life. <laughs> Are you hungry? A lot of people think that Natalie over the last couple of years just doing a handful of races a year is picking and choosing these specific races and just doesn't want to do a full season. And there's a lot that goes into getting the car on track for your driver. We have to find the sponsor. We have to see what the sponsor wants to do for a race, which markets they want to be in. For instance, Daytona and Amped Fitness. The only way that Amped wanted to be on the car is at Daytona, because that's their market. And they wanted to do it in the springtime, so going to Miami at the end of the year wasn't the timing for them. It just worked out, and it was the perfect storm. And it doesn't always work out like that. So that's something that we always have to battle with, trying to find, you know, the big fish that will take us racing all year round. But when you can't find those, we have to go out fishing for the local companies in the local regions that all the tracks are at. Are you ready for me to kick your butt? Is there a different setup? Uh oh, what? that's why. Like that doesn't feel right at all. The track temp is 160 degrees. That would never happen in real life. Okay, maybe. So it's a little greasy. Yeah, I was gonna say there's no grip on the front tires. I'm just like sliding through the corner. I just have to beat your time and then you'll take me on a date. Yeah. You can like coach me through it since you're like the pro eye racer. You're, you need a lot more break than that. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, we're short track racing. To be honest about working with your husband and both having the same passion. Derek wants to be in a race car just as bad as I do. It is a blessing because I wouldn't want it any other way. But to be honest, the start of every race season, it is the hardest thing on our relationship, but it can be really hard because we are grinding so hard to find that next sponsorship, to be at that next race, that sometimes we forget to love each other. On the exit, like don't try and pinch it down. If you are tracking good, like just let it wash up to the wall here, floor it and keep that momentum. Okay, oh wow. I'm so close of beating your time. I'm gonna beat it. I beat your time! Woo! Okay, you owe me a date. <laughs> There's been some tough times, and the tough times really truly just come from us forgetting to turn work off and be a couple. Thank you, Derek, for taking me on this little date today. Of course, I'll never turn down a go-kart date. I'm excited. It's gonna be fun. I, my favorite thing to do with you is racing go-karts together. It's been a minute since we've raced some go-karts. Are you ready for me to kick your butt? Whatever helps you sleep at night. <laughs> I hope you do. 
I already know I'm gonna kick your butt. I, I already know it. I hope you do. Should we, let's bet on it. That means you're improving. If I kick your butt, we get to get crumble cookie tonight. And if we don't, then it's a dessert of my choice. Okay. Deal. <laughs> I'm getting crumble cookie. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm excited. Oh, look at that. Girl things. You might have gloves on. Whose helmet is cooler? Yours. <laughs> look at that thing, it's beautiful. Oh dang, you have a tinted shield. I'm gonna look like a loser. Can we change it quick? No, it's okay. My helmet looks faster, so I'm definitely gonna beat you. Are you ready? Oh good. One of the better ones. One of the, ooh, I'm gonna kick your butt. So I already got him. He said he's gonna knock down the speed for me, make it even. For you? For me? He's gonna knock down yours. No, he's, okay. Like I want that crumble cookie. <laughs> Best date ever. Catch me if you can, Derek. <laughs> Alrighty, we'll give this a shot here. I've blown Derek away. He's not gonna catch me. Not even a chance. Alright, we need a clean lap here. Couple love taps. I love you too, Nats. Woo! <laughs> I'm sorry, that wasn't a burp of me being disgusting. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. Woo! I win! I win! I win! Yeah, Derek, I kicked your butt! How does it feel? I thought I was gonna get you on that last corner, but you hit it perfect. What was that? That wasn't even fair. <laughs> Quit making excuses. You go down the straightaway and you hit me by like 10 parts. <laughs> All right, let's see if they have it printed out. Oh, here it is. Uh, Did I beat him? I know you want yours. Do you, do you really want yours? No, I Oh, wow. Got it from Almost two seconds faster than you. Haha. <laughs> you gotta find a better cart. Good job, Natalie. Good job. <laughs> This is how close we are to our parents. Having my mom and dad, they are literally here in our driveway with their camper and they go from race to race to race and drive their motor home everywhere we're racing, they're there. Working all together as a family, especially Natalie's family, right away I was scared. Quacks. Didn't want to say anything, didn't want to ruffle feathers, anything. I feel like I'm the peacekeeper out of us four. I don't think anyone that works with their family will, will tell you that it's super easy all the time, but in the moments that it's good, it's really good and it's a lot of fun. We're race car drivers. I don't know why we decided to live on a farm. This is not, <laughs> what is going on? Farmers, we are not farmers. If anyone wants a side-by-side, -side, got one for sale. Brand new. Yeah. What's the situation that graces us with your presence? She's coming to say hi to our neighbors. Oh. Since when do you come and sit Dare down in here? You always say it stinks in here. He did just flick out a stink bug. <laughs> I did. Stink bug. <laughs> oh! <laughs> like your, eagles. Derek wants to rip your float. Rip your float? Okay. Oh! If you still had any left. We do. Yeah, let's make him rip your float. Derek, is my dad wearing your pants? <laughs> yeah. I am. Well, they're his pants. I gave them to they're him. They're dirty, too. And turn around. He's got the lumpy shirt on, too. He's trying to be Derek. <laughs> Put, put ice cream but what in kind your... of spoon is that? Hi, baby. Buy this ice cream yesterday. 
No, no, no. no. Wait, Did he give me the old ice cream. Is this a beef? I just got. Is this a beef? Beef? Yeah, we just got yeah, those. It was two toys. Hi, baby. It's a grape. Oh, it's a grape. Good boy. Oh. And I'm thirsty after trip. kicking Derek's butt at the go kart track. I think he had you by a few tenths. Overall speed. Then what these two teamed the paper up on the doesn't lie because we know the truth, but y'all can edit it any way you want. The paper yeah. doesn't lie. <laughs> Just so it's documented, I did beat her fastest lap today. <laughs> There's no proof of that. It is Monday, March fourth. The K one employees can validate. We we're there <laughs> around one o'clock. I wasn't in a go kart. I'm gonna now. go get, I'm gonna go get I would have got top slowest score. <laughs> Do you like it?